I think we really need Buddhist centres and retreat centres um, in this world, uh, sort of beacons of calm um, for people to, well often people just think Buddhism's about de-stressing and learning to meditate and having a quiet moment. And if you've got Buddhist centres in the town, often people will think, ah oh, yeah, we'll go there. And they go to learn to meditate and of course they find something much, much more. And often it's, it's, it's people's first um, experience of, um, well, the Buddha's teaching, um, but normally they get it through just somebody being very kind to them when they arrive and they're welcomed and they feel um, seen. Um, and, and, you know, I, I've visited many Buddhist centres in my time and um, it just feels like such a warm welcome in the midst of a little bit of madness out, you know, in the normal, in the normal world. It's not totally, of course, it's not totally mad everywhere, but it definitely needs these oases for people to find the Buddhist teaching. And I think this, well, the same for retreat centres, um, exactly the same. So people can take time off of their ordinary everyday life, even if it's for a weekend. It's amazing how transformative 48 hours can be away from your computer stream and your mobile and just every normal everyday activities uh, can really get you closer to yourself and um, feel more potential for your life.